To begin processing orders using the touchscreen point of sale system, simply select POS Sales from the POS menu. The touchscreen POS screen is divided into several areas. In the top right, you'll see the quick sale menus. There are eight quick sale menus. Each quick sale menu can have literally hundreds of items assigned to it. If more items are assigned to a menu than can be viewed on the screen at one time, simply use the page up and page down buttons to scroll through the items that are currently visible on the screen. To change to a different quick sale menu, simply select the tab for the appropriate menu that you would like to work with. At the bottom of the screen, you will see that there are several buttons which are available to servers uh, as they are working with the orders to perform functions like voiding items or sales, uh, changing price or quantity, putting orders on account, printing receipts, etc. We'll take a little bit more of a look at each one of these buttons in a moment. Uh, over here on the left, you'll see a list of all of the items which have currently been assigned to the current order. Using the page up and page down functions, you can scroll through the items that appear uh, if the list grows longer than what can be shown on the screen currently. This section will show you the subtotal tax total and change that is due for the customer. The numeric pad here can be used to enter pricing or quantity information as well as check numbers, check amounts, credit card amounts, or cash amounts uh, that do not match the exact amount or the quick sale amounts that have been calculated by the software.